scared. <laughs> I guess this is all part of the town. Quite strange looking to me. Off-putting, off-putting, off-putting indeed. Ah. Uh, the elf friends. That, uh... I put quotation marks around friends. Don't ask me why. I don't want to talk about it currently. Uh, I just know that I would like to leave this disgusting town. This terrible, terrible swamp. Ugh. Ugh. Some music should keep my spirits up. Yes. Who could deny it, hmm? As long as you've got a song in your heart, the road becomes less weary. Da, 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 da. Greetings to you, friend! I will not be distracted by this building again. It has sent me in a giant loop. Alright, onwards and upwards. Bigger and better things await. Hmm, mushrooms, mushrooms. don't know where I am going specifically. Azura's Coast region? Hmm. But the map says nothing. I do not like the sound of coast. I'm not going to do water things. Mm -mm. Where's my... Hmm. Interesting. I have night, please. Don't fall in the water. Don't fall in the water. Hmm. Everything's fine. Everything. Eh, 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 eh. <sighs> Ugh. Stairs. Oh. You little bastard! Ugh. Ugh. You don't know who you're crossing! <laughs> Fool. What is this place? Interesting. Somebody has been doing dark magic. There are scamps. Where there are scamps, there must be necromancers. I don't want to cross that water. So we shall continue. Yeah! You're scared, aren't you? You should be scared. We're all scared. <laughs> That's pretty creepy, huh? When I do that. If he was still alive, he'd totally be creeped out. Alright. Let's, uh. Skip the bow. Oops. That's a waste, it is. How about this? And that. Do you not hear this at all? No effect. He's so strong. This must be a, a scamp of a different nature. Well, let us see if we can teach him some uh, some of our magical tricks. Hmm? Cool. Ah. And what is up here? Any other little friends? Hmm? Hello? No wonder the inn is haunted. You can't expect people to perform foul magic and for there not to be repercussions. And even here, they are not just contained to the temple. You see, they run out, roam the land free. Disgusting. 
They should be ashamed. The uh, berserker, the newly born berserker in me says I should cut them down whenever I should find them. But the bard says, uh, study their culture a bit. Don't be so quick to judge. And uh, I feel they both have merit, <laughs> if I'm to be completely honest. Uh, another leaf racer. I've been out stalking all night for blood. What is this? Scrib. I know this sound. I've spent many, many weeks here now. I know it. I know it all. What is uh, water down there? Oh, are these wild silt striders? Is this what I'm to understand? My goodness. What does it mean? <laughs> what do they want? So, friends. Here we go. Silt Strider Heaven. Also diseased mud crab. Disgusting. I don't want your crab meat. Oh, this is not a silt strider at all. It's not even touching the ground. What kind of creature is this? Oh, the water. The water. The water. The water. Watch out for the water. The water. Get some night eyes so you don't fall in the water. <laughs> it is my greatest composition. Oh, God. This is a dead end for me. I'm sure some people would, uh... Oh, no. Uh-oh. Oh. We're getting into very dangerous territory here. For more reasons than one. I will not melt in the water. It has rained on my head before. However, it's not something I'm willing to experience. It is not like the Silt Strider. The Silt Strider I could experience once and uh, it was relatively okay. It was like sitting on a, a piece of wood. A giant bone. Hmm. So I found that experience uh, not too bad, but every time I experience the water, I hate. <sighs> There is a boat. I can't get on a boat. That is also like riding on wood. <laughs> I can't call up my ex-girlfriend. She knows about riding on the wood. She rode the wood so good. You know this song? Of course you don't. I just made it up. <laughs> Can we go in? Strange shipwreck. Oh, as long as there's no water, I guess we're okay. Hmm. Small chest. A little coin. Don't mind if I do. The pig children. <laughs> ah. No one. Not the oldest Dark Elf of Mount Dagoth Ur or the ancient sage of Solitude himself can recall a time when the orc did not ravage our fair Tamriel. Whatever foul and pestilent Daedra of Oblivion conjured them up could scarcely have created a more constant threat to the well-being of the civilized races of Tamriel than the obnoxious orc. Orcs are thankfully easily <laughs> easy to recognize from other humanoids by their size. Commonly 40 pertons in height and 15,000 angates in weight, their brutal pig-like features and their stench they are consistently belligerent, morally grotesque, intellectually moronic, and unclean. <laughs> By all rights, the civilized races of Tamriel should have been able to purge the land of their blight eras ago, but their ferocity, animal cunning, and their curious tribal loyalty have made them an inevitable as leeches in a stagnant pool. Tales of orcish barbarity precede written record, but when Jagast wrote of the Order of Digenestas, Joining the armies of Daggerfall and Sentinel, 
to hold at bay the wicked orcs in their foul Orsinium fastness and burn the Ott in cleansing flame. In First Era 1950, she assumed that any reader would be aware of the savagery of orcs. When the siege was completed 30 years later, after the death of many heroes, including Gaijin Shinji, and the destruction of Orsinium scattered the orcish survivors throughout the Rothgarian mountains. She further wrote, the free peach people rejoice, for their ancient fell enemy was dispersed into diverse parts. Obviously, the orc had been terrorizing the region of Iliac Bay, at least since the era, the early years of the first era. Hmm. I shall take this. No, I shan't. <laughs> Why is my sheet music so heavy, hmm? Lessons of Vivek. Yeah, this one goes on floor. Thank you so much. the waste. Well, I did not learn anything that I did not know about orcs already, aside from perhaps they have been here a bit longer than I first suspected. Indeed. It seems a shame that uh, some people want to accept the orcs, despite their violent nature, you know? Everybody knows orcs commit crime. Do you want to live next door to one? I don't think so. <laughs> uh, but despite that, I, I have known some, some good orcs. One was an armorer. Yes, one of the best armorers. And he was somewhat accepted into the tribe. You can never tr fully trust them. But uh, it was a begrudging sort of trust. He would make the armor, and we would uh, trade for it. And that's very good prices, too. People would come up to us for uh, moon sugar, and we'd say, Hey, I also got this very special armor. You cannot find this anywhere else. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, I miss. I can't move. Yeah. Ah, Midras, he got me. Come on. Come on. Ah. Ugh. That's not fun at all. Maybe I should try that, uh, that healing bit. Absorb some health from those little guys. It could be a fun prospect. Never do know. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See you again. Goodbye, goodbye. See you, my friend.